I am Brian Jackson. I'm a licensed acupuncturist. I'm a faculty member within the Department of Orthopedics in the School of Medicine here at the University of Maryland. We take care of mostly muscular skeletal patients. Uh, we're part of the spine division of the orthopedics department. So we see a lot of lower back and neck issues related to muscular skeletal pain and chronic pain conditions. Here at University of Maryland, we value non-narcotic pain uh, relief me measures, methods. The idea is that you insert the needle sort of between the fascia of the muscle uh, and form a nice dynamic complex within that connective tissue to try to get the connective tissue to sort of wrap around the needle, which forms a nice dynamic complex. And then via that, we're able to manipulate the structures of the body, regulate neurotransmitters throughout the spinal cord, stimulate deep brain structures, help to, you know, regenerate uh, or, you know, repair dead cells within the area of the needle. So it works on multiple layers and we're not putting anything in and we're not taking anything out of the body, you know, besides these needles. So your ability to heal yourself is going to be based on several different contingencies. So typically those that are generally healthy and don't have multiple complex chronic health issues seem to do better, certainly. Uh, but for the most part, you know, we're able to get our patients relatively symptom free when they leave the office. We offer a minimally invasive means of providing pain relief that is non-narcotic based so that our patients trust us. We have a really good rapport with them. Uh, they understand that we're here to listen to their health concerns and take time and delve into uh, multiple aspects of, of where their disease is, is, is affecting their lives, right? Be it physical or mental or across the gamut, right? Um, so I think that our patients appreciate that we take time with them, that we're concerned with their healthcare issues, and that we want to see them as an entire person and understand uh, not only the physical causes of their pain, but perhaps also like the mental and the environmental conditions as well that may be leading to this. So I, I think they appreciate that.